I recently made a video on how to import a LUT in Sony FX3 and one of my friends was trying to import a LUT and he got this error that this file cannot be loaded. And whenever you see this kind of error in Sony FX3, FX6, FX9, Sony Burano or any other cameras, it can be because of the size of the LUT. So there are standards for LUT sizes like 17 by 17, 33 by 33 and 65 by 65. These are the three standards for LUT. So if there is a LUT which is 65 by 65 and you're trying to import that in a Sony FX3 camera which takes a LUT by default 33 by 33 size, you will not be able to do that and you will get this error. So how can we resolve that issue? To resolve that, you need to convert the LUT from 65 to 33 size. And you can easily do that for free in DaVinci Resolve. And let me just show you how you can do that. So I have opened my laptop and I have this LUT here as you can see and this is a 65 size LUT. So what I will do is basically you can see the LUT 3D size is 65 title and generated by Resolve. So what I will do is I will just copy that first of all and then now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open DaVinci Resolve and I have this project which I was working on so I'll just create a new timeline by command N and I will say that LUT and I'll open it and in here I'm gonna import my footage so basically I have this log footage I will just bring it here drop it on and I'm gonna go to the color page so before I do anything I will just come on this gear icon I will click on it and here on the color management I will come down I will see open LUT folder and I will click on it once I do that, it will open a new folder for me where I have all the LUTs which are installed in DaVinci Resolve. So I will make a new folder here and I will call it test. There you go. And now in here, I will paste that item, that LUT. There you go. I have this LUT now here. I will just close this, go back to my DaVinci Resolve. And in here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just click on update lists and then I will save it. Now. I have imported that lot in DaVinci Resolve. I can apply that lot. So to do that, what I will do is I will just come here. I will right click. I will go to LUT here and then I will look for the test. So this is where I have the test lot. I will click on it. There you go. You can see my light is being applied. If I disable it, this is log and this is with the LUT. So there you go. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna convert it to 33 size. So to do that, first of all, I will come here. And if you don't see this uh, thumbnail here, it is because your clips is not enabled. You see that. So if I enable clip, it will be there. I will right click here. I will go on generate lot. I will go on 33 point cube. So you can see all the three sizes are there. Uh, I will click on it and then I can rename it okay 33 size I will say <coughs> and I can I can put it in the same folder where that one was so there it is and I will say save I'm done with changing the lot size from 65 to 33. In case you want to know how to import a lot in Sony FX3 or FX6 or FX9 or Sony Burano, I've already made videos about that. You can just click on them and watch them. I hope this video was helpful for you. If it was, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more amazing videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one.